Um, so, you know how they say you're supposed to like shoot your bow all year round so you don't get rusty? Well, uh, it's June. Me and Keaton are about to shoot for the first time. <laughs> well, we got three months. It's plenty we of We got three months. We're it's, checking out a new bow range. Got a new bow range. Shooting a 80 pound bow and like 600 grain arrows. It's always exciting the first time you shoot a new target to see whether or not you're going to go straight through it or not. So, here we go. See if I, so you just pull. So do you remember how to do it? You just, you, you just pull. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Bow just explodes. <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time this bow's exploded. Well, I don't think it went through. Oh, maybe it did. I don't see it. Do you see? Yeah, it? I don't see it either. Let's go. <laughs> go check it out. Hey, and you know, first time shooting and. Four and months. He was he was aiming down here <laughs> at the bottom, but he hit up there, so we're good. Uh, we're good. That was shockingly easy, also. Okay, what, this so, what exciting. do you rate this bow range? Well, right now we're at ten out of ten. <laughs> here, when I lose these four arrows in the woods in a second, we'll, we'll downgrade cool. that. Also, we got these nice power line poles back there, so we can bring out our tree saddles and send out some like hundred yard pokes. I bet we could shoot the 15 yard target and it would only be like 70 yards. That's still a poke. <laughs> but you we learned gotta, we learned last year Kyle shoots better at long distance than it's short. It's true. Stuff. Maybe I need to practice more short distance stuff. All right, well, we're going to send some arrows and got a freaking rock we'll, in my shoe. We'll catch up with you in a second. All right. Probably should adjust from 60 yards. I gotta remember how to use this dang thing. Actually, I don't think I have to adjust. I think it's 40. Well, the target's 30, so you might wanna. Well, no, but it's a it's a three pin slider. Oh. I'm pretty sure if I leave it at 40, yeah, it's 20, 30, slider. 40. We're about to find out. If this goes into the woods, <laughs> then that's gonna suck. Well, it hit the target. Hit the target, we're good. Let's see where it hit. Not bad. For the first shot of the year. I mean, that's a that's a dead deer. Maybe, as long as it <laughs> doesn't really go wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So it turns out, I was right on my, my pins. He's right on the I pins. I gotta remember that. That's not how they all work, right? That's just how you set That's yours how up. I set mine up. The bottom of mine's the floater. So that way, because I am shooting 660 something grain arrows, I can still shoot to 90 yards. If my top pin's the floater, I'd probably only be able to shoot 70, maybe. Because at so. 90 is where your arrow starts clipping your sight. 95. I can shoot 90. 95, it starts doing some wonky stuff, <laughs> so. All right, well, we're gonna shoot around and compare who sucks more. It's me. It's it's probably Kyle, but it's, who knows? We'll find out. It's me. All right, <laughs> Kyle shot four arrows. Yep. I shot five. I'm a little high, you're a little low. Yeah, I'm a little low. That one I kind of pulled, but... And then I did have some of them slapped together pretty good, but nothing broke, so I'm not out. No money out yet. <laughs> I'm not out $80 I yet. This is the longest I've ever gone without losing an arrow, or at least five up. Yeah, four shots, that's impressive. <laughs> that's impressive. Hey, five, five hey, shots. You know what's nice about this place? There's not metal beams There's on the side, beams so you can't explode arrows. You'll just well, go into it and never get it out. Yeah, I don't know. Yours I, might explode it still. They might still explode. <laughs> this time I would like to take a moment to thank my sponsors, Sam Land for the release, Keaton Gibbs for the bino harness. <laughs> You're spending three grand for the hat? Oh yeah, the hat. Your free hat. You gave me that free hat. Or your three thousand dollar hat. <laughs> However you want to look at it. Yeah. 
So we did However, a 40-yard group, both of us, and uh, it's not. <laughs> it ain't good. It's not great. It's a good thing we got like three months till season. It's a good thing Kyle's got a lot of sponsors. We got, <laughs> Cause we got a we got a ways to go. Yeah, we're gonna have to tighten the tighten it up a little. We're gonna bit. have to, yeah. Mine's not any better. You'll see. <sighs> yep. Yeah, we we'll, we we'll get there. We we'll, we're still warming up, you know. First arrows in six months. January. I wasn't uh, shooting in January. I probably haven't shot, shot my bow since November. Shot at a deer in January. <laughs> I have I haven't shot my bow since November, maybe. Yeah, mine. Uh, my last arrow felt really good. <laughs> His uh. Side the, to side's not not too bad. No, it's the up and down. And at first, I thought it was my sight. I don't really. My last one felt really good, so I think it could have just been me. You're I don't know. Dropping a little bit. I don't know, huh? You're just dropping a little bit. Yeah. Do you have a form improvement technique for? No, I suck. How's your? Is it is it your target panic keeping you from pulling the pin up? Probably. Let's be real. Need to listen to that. Just everybody rape our form in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> uh. He said rate, not rape. Yeah, yeah, I definitely said rate. <laughs> rate. All right, Kyle claims a mosquito landed on his eye. I swear it landed on my contact, bro. It's probably the only one that hit bullseye. <laughs> it really was. It was the only one that was close. Yeah. So I shot 45 again because my group was so bad. I mean, these that's not bad. That was my first three. And then if the, the mosquito landed on my eyeball. I swear. And then Keaton decided to shoot 50 because he like thought he was good at this or something. Yeah. I mean, and it's not are. terrible. It's been worse been worse i'm getting closer to the bullseye getting closer if you take out those it's okay not good enough to shoot a deer but <laughs> it's okay might be time to back her up to a whole 20 yards and see what happens all right so kyle we're done shooting here for the day we shot probably about 25 30 arrows just took it easy on our first day yeah. what do you uh what do you rate this range well, I didn't destroy any arrows, and I didn't lose any arrows. So, like, I mean, this, that's basically a 9 out of 10. And then there's the deadfall practice. Some people call it telephone pole piles, but I, it's deadfall practice. Uh, I think we're up there. 9 out of 10. There's shade. There's, like, never shade on these things. That's true. There is quite a bit of shade here. So, that's nice. It's got plenty of targets. Yeah. So. What about you, Keaton? I'm going to give it, I'm going to give it a 10. 10. A 10? I mean, there's no people. There's no people. And that's, I hate people. That's big. People I hate suck. people. We got poles out there to put our saddles on. Put our saddles I mean, on. And it's a 95 all the way up to a 55 saddle shot. And then we got 50 yards to 10 yards if we're shooting from where we're supposed to shoot from. So, 10 out of 10. I think if we're going to want to do some long shots, we're probably going to go to the Columbia range. But shout out to... Fulton Parks and Rec. I don't know if that's who actually <laughs> takes care of this or not, but I think they did a pretty dang good job. So, see ya. All right, guys, the range is actually a 12 out of 10. There's deer <laughs> on the range. There's on the range. And there's a sign that says archery hunting here, so I don't know. I think we're just gonna shoot it. I think we're shooting it. <laughs> All right, uh, backstraps for dinner. See you later. Backstraps for dinner, baby.